We're following breaking news of a wildfire in Birmingham. Just a short time ago, this smoke could be seen for miles. We even picked it up on our camera here at the top of Red Mountain. Right now, that fire is closing roads during rush hour, so it might be slow for some people getting home tonight. Good evening. I'm Sherry Jackson. And I'm Jim Dunaway. The fire is burning just off I-20 near U.S. Steel. And we begin tonight with live team coverage of that fire. CBS 42 News reporter Jamie Ostroff's on the scene. And Jamie, we know this started at the back of a business and spread to where you are right now. How contained is it? Well, about 75% contained, Sherry. That was just from Captain Brian Harrell with Birmingham Fire. He just spoke with us a couple of minutes ago. And you can see as we've been here for about two hours watching crews, it's a much clearer picture than before. Uh, we had seen crews battling some thick black smoke, and now it's thinner, more dispersed uh, white smoke. Uh, let's show some video of what this looked like earlier. You can see the difference. Now, as you mentioned, Sherry, this fire did start behind a business off of Tin Mill Road. That's according to Assistant Chief Buddy Wilkes. Uh, he doesn't know which business or how that fire started, but he does know it spread right through that brush, right through the woods, jumped over Inslee Pleasant Grove Road, and it's giving us what we are seeing right now, about four pockets of flames inching closer to U.S. Steel. Now, the good news at this moment is that no homes or structures, even with U.S. Steel, are in danger at this very moment. Now, over 10 trucks, uh, including several from Birmingham, Pleasant Grove, and U.S. Steel Fire are fighting this fire. We also saw some uh, wildfire response teams just get here a few minutes ago with some construction equipment to help out. Of course, these dry conditions are not making anything easier at this time. We made a request to, you, to the state forestry. Uh, they were unavailable because they're working another uh, brush fire in North Jefferson County somewhere. So resources, especially the forestry, are stretched thin. So we're trying, we're having to pick up the slack ourselves without uh, much resources. And we just spun around 180 degrees. I want to show you a second scene here. This is the intersection of Inslee Pleasant Grove Road and Tin Mill Road. You can see police have had this blocked off now for a couple of hours. So if you are planning on heading out this way anytime soon, they say they're going to be here uh, for another couple of hours at least to make sure all those hot spots are put out. So be safe. And I suggest definitely taking another route. We're live in Birmingham. Jamie Ostroff, CBS 42 News.